Let's do some. Oh, ho, 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 ho. because the likelihood is if. Are you in here? Oh, oh the grudge, <laughs> stupid thing. Oh, oh, sweet mother of Jesus. <laughs> Maybe we'll use this. Obviously, if it goes through the heart, we're basically dead. What is up, you two? Welcome back to the Demonologist. We are back on this absolute horror fest again. We're still level two. We're still like basic levels at the moment. So we're still only on the uh, basic map, the abandoned house. Uh, let's just quickly check out the name. Alistair Olsen. Okay. It only answers you when you are alone. Well, the good news for the ghost is that I am alone. So that's terrific. Uh, we're going to go in with the normal sort of stuff. I've worked out that this thing is actually kind of OP. So essentially this, if you ever watch me play Four War, this is essentially the divining rod. So when you put this down, not only does it give you evidence, but it also should give you uh, more interactions as well. There has also been a few updates. One of them being there is a new cursed item, which is the voodoo doll, which works the same way as the have we got Ouija board no as the uh, voodoo doll out of Faz uh, it's right in front of me as well I can see it so this is the new voodoo doll so if I put this down maybe we'll use this obviously if it goes through the heart we're basically dead it went through the heart holy crap well I'm dead I'm dead. There's no way we survive this. I don't understand how that's fair. Wait, are you still following me? Oh. I need to run away. Well, this is an interesting start to the game. We also now know where he is as well. I safe. Hello. What just happened? One thing I will definitely say is he's slow. Holy bananas. Well, we found him. He's in the kitchen area. So that's good news. Wow, I, I, as if we would get the heart one straight off the bat. Or at least we found it, I suppose. Right, let's put this down. He's right at the front door. We should be safe now. What just happened with that hunt? I don't know how I've just survived that. Okay, uh, EMF five maybe. No EMF two. Okay, well let's let's drop everything. My sanity must be tanked, though. My sanity must be low. The only thing I can think of, though, is that that ghost was slow. We easily outran that. So I'm wondering, and that, this, I've got so many questions right now. How did that ghost hunt only last for like five seconds? How did we escape the ghost? As if we would get on the, on the brand new update, the first time we used the voodoo doll, we get the heart one. Our sanity is only 87% as well. So that's good news. Let's take this with us. Okay, so let's go with the fact that it's quite slow. Now, there, there is a slow ghost. Iblis is known to be the concerns and see where its prey is, even from a distance. Even if you're close enough to the Iblis, you can hear blah, blah, blah. If it decides to hunt, it may be impossible to escape as it knows your location. Weaknesses. It moves more slowly if it is close to its target. I don't know what's going on in this game. I somehow have... I suppose Iblis is the first one, so... Iblis or Iblis, potentially this could be what that. This could definitely be the Iblis. Because it was ridiculously slow. We easily outran that. All right, well, let's put, it's definitely in the kitchen. Look for uh, ectoplasm stains, maybe. So for the ectoplasm stains, we're looking for, they're almost like brush marks on the wall. Holy crap balls. Yeah, so that, oh, there's another one there as well. So ectoplasm stains is like uh, if someone had a paintbrush and they just brushed the wall. That's basically what that is. So we've also got... Let me get outside for a second. It's Everything's going off. What's happening? Uh, so what did, what did we just get? 
We've only got ectoplasm stains. Oh, so it can't be an eye blitz then. Okay, interesting. Let's do some talking. Uh, I heard something. Fours. Smash plates. Oh, five. Oh, sweet Jesus is going off in there. EMF five. Uh, a Yuri or a Wraith? Okay, let's have a look. Yuri. Uh, it may weaken itself if alone. Okay. And a Wraith. Wraith. We do not have any... That's brilliant. It's just turn off the light as well. Where's the... What is going on in here? What is going on? Where are you? Are you here? Are you friendly? Holy babies! Jeez, did I not bring the thing in with me? Where's the... I didn't bring... Wait, what? I'm so confused. Just turn... It's definitely going to be um, fingerprints. It's 100% going to be fingerprints. For some reason, I didn't bring fingerprints in with me. It's definitely going to be Wraith. Oh, it's 100% Wraith. Are you here? Are you friendly? Where are you? There's no way. We'd have had voice response already. How have I not come across... How did I not bring the fingerprints let's just launch something outside holy crap i'm gonna die i'm gonna die okay i'm guessing it's fingerprints let's just double confirm it though let's go i don't understand how i didn't bring the fingerprints with me i thought i had three slots available but obviously not it's it's definitely going to be wraith out of interest what is the wraith what does the wraith do what are we saying oh the wraith is we got nothing for the wraith okay well, the Wraith is slow. We know that. Like, that Voodoo doll that instantly we got the heart. I'm going to take that one as well. Uh, instantly we got the heart. And it was... I mean, we easily outrun that. It's, it's, initially, it was running after us, like, quickly. But we managed to loop it. And then also, it just started walking. And we easily got away. I don't know. I don't know what to make of that. Got any finger, fingerprints? There we go. Easiest game of my life. So let's do what we're going to do as well, actually, though. We're going to do the side quest. So we know it's a Wraith. Oh, hang on. Fingerprints. Wraith. So we're going to do the side quest, which basically is... We need the ESG thing. Where is it? Down there. Okay. Let's do this. So what we're going to do is there is a little girl who sits on a chair. Uh, she's kind of invisible to the naked eye. So we need to use this. To... Holy bananas, mate. What are you doing in here, child? So we need to look for her. Now, like I said, you can't see her without using the SG. So I'm going to look in here quickly. I don't think she'll be in here. No, she's going to be at the end. Uh, she could be in here, though. No. Uh, door's open. She could be in here. Are you going to spawn? Probably not. I don't think she can go in there. Let's try in here. Okay, she's not in here either. That's interesting. Uh, not over there. I don't know where she is then. I'm trying to think where she could be. Maybe in the basement, potentially? Uh, I've checked in here, right? Let's have another look around. No, she's definitely... I mean, I'm assuming that this is going to be one of the tasks that we've got to do. I don't know what that was. Hello? You in here? Oh, there she is. Hello. Creepy. Look at her face. Her face is creepy as hell. That's a creepy face. No offense. Right, let's get out of here. Okay, well, that's literally been the easiest game of my life. I cannot believe how easy that was. So we're going to go on. We also probably got quite a bit of money for that. So maybe 650, I'm guessing. 
So let's go on to game number two. Hopefully we can get to rank three and then we can unlock the the next map, which I have yet to go on. So I'm not looking forward to that one yet, but uh, let's just double check 65% and we did do that one. We need solid photo of the ghost and then ghost blow out of the candle. Potentially, because we've just got 600 bucks, we might buy a candle and let's see if we can do both of them. So let's move on to game number two. All right, guys, game number two. Uh, we did get 650 bucks for that, and we also just bought a candle. Uh, where's the candle? There it is. Can I just ask, how the hell is that six, 600 bucks for that candle? I'd want this candle to transform into another human being to help me for that price. I don't know. Do we need a lot? Oh, no, okay. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like that. Okay, we won't do that just yet. We're going with the normal sort of stuff. This, this, and this. Uh, actually, let's have a check of the name. Hermione Callahan. Okay, so we've got Harry Potter going on in here. Wait, it only responds... Yeah, of course. So Hermione is in the building. We've, uh, we're probably going to get some spells cast in our way. Uh, let's uh, maybe Voodoo Doll again. Surely we can't get the heart again. The idea for the voodoo doll, I think, is that we need to we need to get the pin. Ouija boards? No Ouija boards. Voodoo dolls? No voodoo dolls. And no Ouija boards. Interesting. Okay. Let's do some... Oh! <laughs> Hello, mate. You're right. What are we running for? Olympics. Let's get out of here. It's, uh... Have those bones always been there? I don't remember seeing those last time. What we want to do as well is we actually want to open these doors because the likelihood is if... Oh my God. Holy crap balls. How did... How did the EMF not go off? And secondly, that is an absolute ridiculous jump scare. Oh my god, that was ridiculous. I, if you guys had earphones in then, my god, your ears must be bleeding after that. That is also that was the grudge. That was the grudge. Oh, voodoo doll, we do have it. Okay, right. Well, let's do voodoo doll. There's no way we get heart again. Light switches. I heard that. Over here. Are you in here, though? I think you were a bit further along. I don't think... Hello, hello, hello. Oh, were you in here? Oh, no, it's... Are you in here? Oh! Oh, the grudge. <laughs> stupid thing. I think it's in here. Okay. Right, let's shut these doors. Actually, no, we'll leave these open. Actually, is it in here or is it in here? It sounded further away than that, you know? I think it's... It's somewhere... It, it didn't sound that close, the light switches. Come on, hello. I don't think it was this one. It was either this one... Or the hallway. But we did get a four here, though. But now I'm not getting anything. It's absolutely death, deathly silent again. Okay. Just, just quiet. What's going on? Thing is, I don't want to use the voodoo doll again. Because I'm risking it doing the heart. And I don't really want that. I'm not hearing anything. Where are you? Can you show yourself? Oh! Oh, that was the ESG! Oh! 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 Okay, yep, it's kicking off now. That was the ESG. It's also just throwing bottles. Okay, this thing is pissed. 
Let's get out. Oh my god, this ghost is active. What's an active ghost? Holy crap balls. Okay, that was ESG though. So when the ghost uh, manifests itself and kind of T poses like that, like that, it's a bit weird. I'm, I'm assuming they'll probably change that. But when it T poses like that, that's the ESG. Uh, so let's do. So we've definitely got ESG. We didn't get a uh, five. What would be a five? Okay. Okay, so it can't be a Gorio because a Gorio is similar to the Faz ones. Oh no, not that. So it can't be EMF five then. Because a Gorio won't show ESG unless we're outside the room. So we need a camera for that. The same as Faz. So that's good. So technically, is there anything else that would be Gorio? Uh, okay, so it can't be fingerprints either. Interesting. Okay, so it can't be fingerprints, can't be EMF. Wow, we've narrowed this down loads just with one piece of evidence. Iblis. Um, what was the Iblis? The slow one. We haven't had freezing yet. Okay, let's go. I reckon we go spirit. Maybe easel. Spirit and easel. What we like sanity wise? 86%. Holy. Probably because of the grudge thing in the basement. That was ridiculous. I was not expecting that. I've never had that jump scare before. So yeah, that was uh that was terrifying. 86% though. We need to be careful. I don't know I don't know the ranges of hunts for these ghosts just yet. I'm expecting a jump scare. Okay, no, we're fine. We're fine. This hallway is so much more open with that chair gone. I'm coming in. Be scared. Okay, let's do canvas. Are you here? Where are you? Yep. Yeah. Oh, man. What they need to do is when it says I am behind you, they need to have it spawned behind you. I think that'd be awesome. Spirit Box. Okay. A, a Gwipo or a Gwipo and an Iblis. Okay, so Iblis is quite slow. So freezing can't be. So easel or ectoplasm stains. Uh, let's go. I guess we might as well just go get ectoplasm stains for now. Can I see? No, I can't see it from here. Let's get the F out of here. Uh, it's just shut the door. Fingerprints isn't an option, though. But potentially ectoplasm maybe on that one. Oh, man. But yeah, so Voodoo Doll is kind of OP. Because it gives you, every time you push the nail in, it gives you an interaction. Uh, and then the heart, obviously, you, you basically die. Although somehow we managed to survive. But let's go. So let's do this. We don't need that. We've got a candle. Um, okay, so let's take candle in as well. Because once we get the piece of evidence, we're going to want to do this quick. I didn't check my sanity either. I, I'm going to assume we're probably around the 80 mark. So I reckon below below 70 is when we need to start worrying. Oh, actually, let's have a look. So what's a Gwipo and an Iblis? Iblis. Oh, we know this one, so it moves slowly. Iblis is known to be a type of ghost that can sense and see where its prey is, even from a distance. If you are close enough to Iblis, you can, you can hear and use words that other ghosts won't. Okay, so it says stuff that other ghosts don't. I haven't really heard anything yet. If it decides to hunt, it may be impossible to escape as it knows your location. Oh, so the Iblis is like a Dio from Faz. Yeah, the Iblis is literally a Deogen. Interesting, because we've got a Deogen on there. Oh, okay, that's weird. And then what we got? A Gwipo or a Gwipo. Of course, we don't have any data on that. It's a shame that when we do find this ghost, it doesn't give us like an interaction for it. I'm expecting a jump scare. No, okay. I hate the fact that I'm expecting it and it doesn't happen because then like I calm down and then something happens. All right, mister. Oh, ectoplasm stains. Yes, mate. Okay, so we know what it is now. Ectoplasm stains, guipo. We have no information on this thing. So now... What we're going to do is going to put this down. That should blow out the candle. We also now need to find the girl. That Holy bananas. Are you hunting? I assume you're not. Are you are you luring me in here for any particular reason? There's no girl in there. Any girl in here? You gotta you gotta like watch out for it though because she's kind of sneaky. She blends in. I need you to blow out the candle for me, please. 
Anything over here? No. I don't know where to expect this thing, though. It, I mean, it could be... Oh, there she is. Hello. What are you serving? Why are you sat there, you weirdo? What are you making? Oh, you're on the saw. Of course you are. Yeah, I'm out. Bye. Okay, so we just need the candle to go out now. I don't know if we need to be in while that's happening. Hey, can you blow out the candle for me? Okay. Don't throw flammables at it. Jeez. Okay, let's do some talking to it. Are you here? Are you friendly? Oh! What are you? Okay, it seems to be over here, so let's put this over here. There you go. Have that. Can you speak? Are you here? Where are you? I am looking for you. Oh my god, did that did that just say I'm looking for you? I need to be careful here. I need it to blow out the candle. Okay, here. Can you blow out the candle? Cool. Can you blow out the candle? Oh, sweet mother of Jesus. What, in, what on earth was that? Excuse me. Can you blow out the candle for me? Okay. Are you friendly? Why? You know what? Why won't you blow out the candle? Why's oh, blowing out the candle? Oh, I'm out. Bye bye. Holy. Okay, we're absolutely smashing this, by the way. Absolutely smashing this. So we've got the candle, we've got the gird on the chair, and we've guessed the ghost right. So that's going to be about 700, I think. The only other thing we've got to do now is take a photo of the ghost. So I don't think we have enough money to buy the camera yet. If we do, then I'm going to be using it in the next one. We'll do we'll do another one. We'll do one more and see if we can complete the whole thing. Hopefully we unlock level three. 78%. We actually did really well there. Uh, Hermione. Oh, I should have used the name a bit more. Uh, solid photo of the ghost. Okay. Let's move on to game number three. If we've got enough money for the camera, then we'll buy it. Uh, if not, we'll just try and smash it out again. But game number three, here we go. All right, guys, game number three. And we managed to buy a camera. But I think I messed up because the camera that I bought, I think this is not a photo cam. It doesn't automatically take a photo. I think this is more like the fast cams where you can see what's going on in the room when you're not there which kind of sucks because i wanted to buy the photo cam but oh well we've got this one. i guess we've got this one as well we also managed to buy some sanity pills although i don't know where they are oh, there they are so sanity pills will come in handy especially if we come across a ghost that will absolutely drain our sanity to bits so we've got a candle we can't do the photo challenge but we can do the ectoplasm challenge as well and the girl sitting on the chair challenge so let's get back in here let's hope with something juicy It'd be interesting to see if we get a Gorio, because then we can test out the camera and see if it works. But let's get in here. Any Ouija's? No Ouija's. No um, voodoo dolls either. Interesting. I'm hearing noises. I'm trying to listen to see if I can hear anything. Maybe let's go over here and see if we can see voodoo doll. Because last time it spawned in here, right? Voodoo doll? No voodoo dolls. Okay. Potentially Ouija board, maybe? Oh! I think we found it. Oh, yeah, we've... Oh, my God. It's a five straight off the bat. We might be in trouble. Yeah, we might be in trouble. Holy crap, it's active. This is an active ghost. Holy bananas. We might be in trouble here. All right, well, let's turn this on. Put that down there. Try and get all three pieces of equipment. Okay, EMF-5, straight off the bat. 
this is an active ghost. It'll be interesting to see how much our sanity has drained just from those two interactions. Because that is going to be the quickest I've ever found the spot, the ghost room. And also the quickest I've seen that kind of interaction. I mean, we literally lost 1%. So, oh, we didn't check the name. Olive Lindsay. Okay. Double first name. I like it. Let's do spirit box. Maybe do ectoplasm as well. And... Yeah, let's do ectoplasm, easel, and spirit rocks. I think these three are quite important and probably the easiest to get. I feel like fingerprints is actually quite difficult. Like the only way that I think I feel like there has to be more ways of getting fingerprints because at the moment it's just doors and it switches. And if it touches the doors and it needs fingerprints, then normally it will happen. Why can I not say? Oh, okay. Um, I think maybe we just go in. I'm probably gonna get jump scared here. No, okay. Every time I say that, I don't get jump scared. Let's turn this on. Let's have a look. Any ectoplasm? No ectoplasm at the moment. Not necessarily means that, uh, or doesn't necessarily mean that it's not happening. Let's put that down there. Are you here? Where are you? Are you here? Are you friendly? Where are you? To be fair, this is like... It might not be in this room. It might be in the next room. Hello? Where are you? Okay. That light is flickering. Are you here? Oh, okay. Where are you? What is that? It looks like soul. Let's also just turn the light off as well. Where are you? Are you here? Are you friendly? Okay, definitely can't be spirit box surely we've got emf5 so we don't care about that there definitely isn't any ectoplasm at the moment either ectoplasm nothing there is literally no ectoplasm at all what is going on on this one i'll tell you what let's put the esg down here a bit so we can actually see it Easel, are you doing anything? No, nope, we've got nothing. Okay, it might be worth getting the camera, you know. Yeah, let's go get the camera. Just realized as well, I didn't actually pick up my torch, did I? No. I wonder what the uh, first item was. It must have been spirit box. It must have been the library. Okay, so we've literally only got EMF5. No ectoplasm at the moment. I think fingerprints. I definitely feel fingerprints. But I'm also thinking no to the spirit box. Like, we were talking non-stop. What's our sanity like? 91%. Okay, this is not an aggressive ghost. Let's do this. Let's go camera. Sanity pills we don't need right now. Maybe we go... Maybe we go candle. No, let's go... Let's do this again. Let's do another light. Uh, what was the name? Olive Lindsay, wasn't it? Olive Lindsay. Okay. I wonder if it will interact with us more if we say the name. I haven't tried it yet, so maybe we try that. It's it's quite weird. I wonder if we're going to see a jump scare on this bit here. Oh, okay. I'm, like, looking through the screen. What am I seeing? Oh. Uh, wrong way. Is that freezing? Freezing. Okay, that makes sense. Also, there's got to be fingerprints. Yeah, fingerprints. We've got it already then. We smashed it. EMFI, fingerprints, freezing. It's an Oni. Oh, an Oni is the one that drops your sanity instantly, right? It's known to be very fast and it will play with your sanity. Oh, God. Yeah, we need to be careful then. Okay, oh, yeah, hello. How's it going, mate? Yeah, get me out of it. Right, so we got camera down. We now need candle. And then we need to use the um, ectoplasm glass eye thing. 
Okay, so we need to be careful because it will drop our sanity like crazy. So I'm thinking maybe we go in with sanity pills. Maybe we go in with candle. And we, we just sit around and wait. It's a shame that we can't see what our sanity is while we're inside. Sanity is still 90%, so it's really not doing anything at the moment. All right, we've got candle as well. We're going to light this bad boy. Then we need to start walking around with the ectoplasm glass. We could get a full house on this one, and this will actually take us to level three, which is going to set us up nicely for the next episode, which is going to be on the new map. And I cannot wait because I don't know what to expect. So weird how we haven't found any sort of... Um... Also, we haven't had any jump scares. What's all that about? We've literally had nothing. This is like the most passive ghost ever. As soon as I say that. As soon as I say that. Okay. Is that you doing your special ability? Alright, let's look for the little girl on the chair. There she is. Hello. You're terrifying. Did I just blow out the candle as well? No, what's that? What is going on in here? Okay, we can't take a... Oh my god, this thing's going nuts. I need it to blow out the candle. Can you blow out the candle? Olive Lane. No, Olive Lindsay, sorry. It's definitely going nuts. Right, we don't actually need this anymore. Can you blow out the candle? To be fair, we don't really need to be in here. I just need the candle to blow out. So let's just get the F out of here. Because I do not want to die, especially if the Oni is going to absolutely tank our sanity like crazy. It's not worth the risk. It's just not worth it. Oh, man. I cannot believe how quickly we got that Oni. That is ridiculous. So we definitely got the girl in the chair. And then we just need the, the candle to blow out. And then that is almost a full house. Then we just need a photo of the ghost, which... We will have enough after winning this one. We'll have enough to... Where's the candle? Is there? We'll have enough to... Uh, 87% to get, go on to the next level for starters and also buy the photo camera. I don't actually know if you need money to unlock the next map. I think it just automatically unlocks. Yeah, solid photo of the ghost. Okay. What's our sanity? 87 we could potentially go back in there. But I don't know if we need to. Oh. Oh, what was that? Oh, I just saw it manifest. Okay, so you don't actually need to be in the house for it to manifest still. That's good to know for like a Gorio. And Holy bananas. Yeah, we saw that. Oh, yeah, it's active. Holy bananas, yes. We just need to blow out the candle. Come on, mate. Blow out the candle. What are you doing? Look at that placement for the easel as well. That is like perfectly dead center. What's going on there? That's next level. Yeah, I cannot believe how quickly we got the EMF 5 as well. Come on, man. I need you to blow out the candle. The problem is as well, if I go back in, I know for a fact. I mean, it's, it seems to be... Oh, no. Okay. I know for a fact that it's going to tank our sanity. Probably attack us and then we're going to die. I can't believe how long it's taken to blow out the candle. I don't know if I need to be in there, though, you know. Maybe we need to be in there. Well, though, it did manifest itself while we, while we weren't in there. And you do actually get quite a bit of money. You get like a hundred bucks for it. Okay, I think we go in there. I think we go in. I don't really want to risk not getting the candle blown out. I also don't really want to die, but I feel like... The Oni is very fast, apparently. So, we could instantly get hunted here. So, we do need to be very careful. I'm expecting a jump scare. Where's all the jump scares today? Yeah, I can see you throwing stuff, but you're not doing the candle. Can you blow out the candle? Actually, you know what? What's that? It's a bit better. I don't want to go in there because I feel like it's just going to... 
See, if we hold the candle, I think it won't tank our sanity, right? I think that's the thing, maybe. See what, we'll go in. We'll go in. I'm going to turn the light on, though. We're going to stand near the candle, because I think our sanity doesn't drop if we stand near this. Can you blow out the candle? Oh. oh thank you. Bye. Holy crap. Okay. Ask and you shall receive, I guess. Is that all it took? Oh, my God. Okay. Well, we've absolutely smashed that. I think we've gained about 750 for that one. We've definitely unlocked level three after this. And we can now buy the photo camera. So this is, like I said, this is setting us up perfect for the next uh, episode, next video. Oh, man. On a new map. I assume it's probably going to be going to be massive. You see the state of that thing? That what the hell was that? Oh my god! Thank God we got out of there. Wait, where's the? Oh, it's still there. Blended in. Okay. Well, there we go. Smashed it. Seven fifty. We definitely know. I mean, it has to be. It has to be an oni. One hundred percent. That was probably the easiest oni I've ever come across. But 750, moving on to the next video, we're going to be going on to the new map using all the equipment. We're most likely going to lose it all as well.